This Canadian spy drone has just helped to topple the Libyan regime of Muammar Gaddafi. The, the Libyans were quite aware that they, they were fighting blind on the ground. With neither time nor money available to buy expensive helicopters or predator drones, the rebels did what many other consumers might do. The same way that a lot of customers find us, and that's simply through the website. Okay, it was a little more complicated than that. But within days, the rebels had their very own backpack portable spy drone. It can be assembled and ready to fly in under a minute. Dave took 42 seconds to put this one together. And it's in battlefield shape. This needs to work not just on nice, calm, sunny days. It has to work in the hot, the cold, the rain, the snow, dirt, dust, whatever the world could throw at it, because that's when our customers will need to use it. And those customers come from everywhere. The U.S., British and Canadian military, police services from London, England to Halton region, survey companies, search and rescue teams. The uses are almost unlimited. BP is a customer, for example, uh, that bought some during the Gulf oil spill last year um, and have been doing some trials up in Alaska to do oil spill response and coastal monitoring. And as you can see, this is a very, very small and compact unit. Heck, it's like a toy at home. No offense intended. In fact, it's deceptively simple looking from the outside. It looks like a little gray box. But once you realize the amount of computing power that's on the inside that takes care of everything so that the operator doesn't have to think about it, you know, that's where the real secret sauce is. You could even use it to keep an eye on nosy news media. So the uses of the Scout are really limited only by your imagination. If you can think of it, the Scout can probably do it. And you may be seeing a lot more of them around your place soon. In Waterloo, Scott Urquhart, CHCH News.